I see a lot of problems with people in their setups. They stand too close, they stand too far, they have too much bend at the waist and hips, not enough bend at the waist and hips, too much bend at the knees, on and on and on. What I'm about, the test I'm about to show you isn't completely foolproof, but it's gonna give you an idea. You've heard the, the cliche that you want your hands hanging below your shoulders, okay? This is a good way to figure out if all of those things, bend, bend here, bend here, distance from the ball, is if you address the ball, okay, if I let my right arm just hang straight down, you can see that's pretty even with the grip. Left hand, same thing. If I bend too much of the waist, see, outside the grip. If I'm standing too far from the ball, inside the grip. If I'm too bent at the knees, inside the grip. So obviously some of these things are slight exaggerations, and I mean only slight. But if you get into at least, the very least, a decent posture, here, here, and distance from the ball, your hands are gonna hang somewhere close to where the grip is. Now, this is with irons. With driver, most great drivers of the ball actually reach for it just a little bit. So when, excuse me, when you do this on driver, you want the grip to be just slightly outside of where your hands hang, all right? So this isn't foolproof. You can still make some mistakes in your setup and still, not, and still be able to pass this little test. But passing this test goes a long way to showing that you're pretty close in your setup.